Shouldn't we be having fun with some of these kind of masks? Calling Guar, calling Slipknot, calling every Lucha Libre wrestling mask maker, you know, put a little gauze over the mouth and you could make money hand over fist at this. I mean, you could do that kind of a mask, which I think is from maybe uh, Indonesia, or if you want, there's always this kind of a mask. You know, you, you, you could have all kinds of fun with this. Or keep it simple and just use the old uh, serial killer mask or something. This is actually a uh, ski mask for snowshoeing, rock climbing, cross-country skiing, you name it, that I drew little zits on before I used it at a few shows at Dead Kennedy's. And, uh, well, yeah, let's get straight here. Here we go. How about a wrestling mask? Hard to get on my big fat head, so... Here we go. You know, have everybody walking around in wrestling masks. Put a little bit over the mouth. You know, maybe use this or something. How's that for a mask to protect yourself from coronavirus? Or for that matter, this birthday present I got from a prosthetics guy in Vancouver when I was up there one year. You know, how about this? This will protect you. I want to go walking around with this thing on for now. How's that? And meanwhile... Another opportunity was missed for crying out loud, but you could still do it with everybody cowering in their homes. Bring them a little tale of unemployed ticks so at least everybody can enjoy Corona and Lyme.